I'm going to show you how to manually start the Sizemore trucking generator um, via the Quick Panel Junior panel. Um, this is if for some reason the communication's been lost between dispatch and the site and also the cell signal through the IONTRA website um, isn't being received. It uh, could be due to cell reception um, or the system being down. Um, if you do need the, the generator in an event where both communication means have been lost and you need to manually start it, the machine uh, should be in its auto state waiting for a signal from dispatch. Um, so the generator breaker should already be in its auto position. To check that you can just go ahead and trip it. And then to put the breaker back in auto, just one click to the right. I'll hear a click. Make sure that the breaker switch in auto light says it is in auto and it's not flashing. And then from the main screen you want to go to system control and your options are under engine start control are, I don't know if it can be seen, but remote, which is its default state, uh, waiting for a remote signal through the cell signal or uh, PSNH dispatch, local engine start, local engine stop, and reset. So in order to do a local engine start, you just go ahead and hit the local engine start button. The machine will crank, um, come up to voltage and frequency, and with the generator breaker in its auto position, it will go ahead and sync to the grid um, and ramp up at a rate of, um, it'll come up to one megawatt uh, at a ramp time of five minutes. Um, once the machine is online, it can be um, monitored from, from the site here at Sizemore Trucking uh, and, and depending if you have um, communications back, you'll be able to see any incoming alarms, but to shut it down, you'll have to do it manually because the machine will no longer be in auto mode because you started it in manual mode. So in order to shut it down manually, all you do is hit local engine stop. And then the engine will, um, will come down. Um, it'll unload at a rate of uh, the one megawatt will unload, unload within five minutes. Breaker will trip open and then the engine will go into a five minute cool down and stop. At that point, you can go ahead and place the engine back in uh, remote status where it's waiting for a signal uh, either from the dispatch at PSNH or through the cell signal through the website. And that's how you manually start and stop the generator at Sizemore Trucking Facility.